Our final reader for the evening is Phil Hall. His first small book, 18 Poems, was published by Cyanamid, the Canadian mining company, in Mexico City in 1973, before I was born. <clears throat> Among his many <laughs> Thank you for laughing. Among his many titles are Old Enemy Juice, 1988, The Unsaid, 1992, and pronounce the next one for me, Hearthedral, beautiful title, A Folk Hermetic, 1996. In the early 80s, Phil was a member of the Vancouver Industrial Writers Union and also a member of the Vancouver Men Against Rape Collective. He has taught writing at York University, Ryerson University, Seneca College, George Brown College, and elsewhere. He's been a poet in residence at Sage Hill Writing Experience in Saskatchewan, the Pierre Burton House in Dawson City in the Yukon, and elsewhere. In 2007, Book Thug published Phil's long poem, White Porcupine. In 07, he met his wife, Anne, she's here with us tonight, walked the Camino de Santiago de Compostela. He's a member of the Writers' Union of Canada and lives near Perth, Ontario. Recent books include An Oak Hunch and The Little Seamstress. In 2011, he won the, Gan the Large Goose's, the Canada Governor General's Award for Poetry for his most recent collection, Killdeer, a work the jury called a masterly modulation of the elegiac through poetic time. If you have to say that quickly, you are in big trouble. Killdeer was also shortlisted for the 2012 Griffin Poetry Prize of Excellence, and Phil was awarded the Trillium Book Award. His new book is The Small Nouns Crying Faith, also with Book Thug 2013. Please welcome Phil Hall. <laughs> 